Here in Dakar, we've got the second of the doubleheader. Duranto Rashahi versus the Silette Royals. Here at the National Stadium. Tossed a little while ago with Aaron Lull. Was won by the Silette Royals and they're gonna bowl first. Are the men in green. Now, big chance here for Rajshahi to jump up to the top of the table. If they win this game here against the Cellar Dwellers, the Royals, they go right to the top of the table and kick on there, and they need to do that. And you'd hope so, really, for the BPL, the inaugural tournament, because it's a Friday. Big holiday day where they can all come along, and those in yellow, they are not mellow. They're amped and pumped and ready to go. Now then, got a slip in, and why wouldn't you? You've got Sahail with the new ball in hand, and he's up against the right-handed uh, Shazir. First ball! Big roar from this big crowd. And Dakar to go with third man. There's that bit of movement. And it allows Shazir to get off the mark with just a single. Here we go. First one for Sadiq. Tails in and knocks him over. Oh, yes. Could this be a little bit of a party pooper scene on a Friday? Well, it could be. Because right side to side to continue playing shots like that. First ball that Siddiqui faces. Expansive shot. Expansive. That's not the kind of shot you want first ball. That's the first ball duck. Very, very talented, and two half centuries, a best of 72 here in the BPL. His first ball, and it's a peach. Swings and no surprises that we've got a second slip in with the new man in. A bit too short here, Trago, and that's been his problem. A little too short, and this has happened on too many occasions for Pete Trago. Coming up, Miles sorting things out from the keeping position. There's a short one that nips back. And this one nips off the blade quite smartly. There's another one. Off the front foot too, Dan. Just picked the length up. Saw that the ball was coming into him. There's the end dipper. And with the natural shape of the ball, played it on the onside. So they're just playing for pride of performance. And let's have three boundaries in the Trago over. Oh, brilliant. 14 from it. It's 18 for one. So we've had two singles, and now we've had three dot deliveries. The pressure starts to mount in the third over for the batting side. Four on the off and three inside the circle. Round the wicket, and there is Styrus. Picked him out, did Marlon Samuels. Just two from the over, it's 20 for one. You can make out he's not one to fight the ball. He's going to push it through. Bit of a mix-up. Could have been costly, but fortunately for the right size, no damage done. Yeah, I just think there, though, if Samuels was backing up, they could have made that. Don't have to bother uh, running a quick single for that. Just run a quick fellow to go and pick up the ball out of the fence. Smiles if you're dressed in yellow. Well, let me anyway. I'm supporting them. Spent to the man at extra cover, and he's got his man. This is what the Salad Royals want. Nafisa's up in her seat, and she's loving this. At least there's a smile on her face. Good wicket, this. Big one. Marlon Samuels wanted to go over the top. Really no need for that. And Raju has the all-important wicket. Marlon Samuels is the big one he's netted. Got 136 runs in uh, the BPL. 
what I liked about him so far, little Mush, is he's withstand pressure all the time. Every time he comes in, his team are under pressure and he's delivered almost. I just remember it's 40 for three, 30 for three, 47 for three. He's come in every time. That's what he's done. And he's delivered. Last ball coming up. Oh, he's got his man, I think. I think he's got his man. What an over. In swinging, Yorker length delivery took him by surprise. Mushfikur also walks back. Raju's on fire. And so are the crowd, because this is a big wicket. Now look at the swing. He set him up with three in a row that swung the other way. The outswingers, there were three of them. And then he brought one back, and the keeper's now happy. Yes, please. Good thing for Select Royals. The captain, Mushfikur, goes for no, 25 for three. For Kulna versus Silet. Brett Lee is his favorite cricketer. What a start he's provided. What an over. That's also in the air, but it's in the gap as well. Is it going to carry through? Yes, it does. Shazeb is carrying on in the same fashion, undeterred by the fall of wickets. They have a lot of experience. I'm a sector, I'm a business sector, I'm a better performance for this. All right, um, we're going to take a break. Over to you guys at the com box. Four to end the over. It's 34 for three. The Amra capable, we can do something. Amra the capacity, I say, the proof will be the same. Amra, it's a part of the BPL. Amra, the BPL is the same. 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 Giving too much room and bowling it too short outside the off stump now, young man. Not getting it right. He's just looking for pace. He's trying to get to bowl faster and faster. Not the way to go on a slow track. He had a big beginning. Don't spoil it all now. He just dragged it down a little bit. Once it was short, he could just use the pace of the ball. Try and get some extra purchase out of the wicket. Like that. Well, that's nicely played too from the teeth, got to say. Another one of those little toppy wrong ends. And uh, just watched it nicely all the way onto the blade Latif. Raju was impressive, so is Noah Hussain. No run there. And 50 was brought up with that lovely late dad from Latif. It's moved, Rashahi, that's what they want, but they've lost three wickets. They've got to take it a little steady at the moment. Straight up and safe. The Royals want a bit more luck. Nine gone, it's 51 for three now. Faisal next to him, having a smile, serve, feeding us with wonderful bits of information that we take credit for. Danny, but that's what it away. That's a very welcome boundary, a release of the tensions. Great release, because the first two balls are running off at two. And there is one of those much-needed boundaries. They haven't hit one for some time. Nice execution, and no chance for Sahail Tanbir. Well, in a way, Shaman, that sums up the Royals' campaign. Played seven, lost seven, have not executed the different facets and skills of the game. At times they've been good with the ball, at times they've been okay with the bat. And then some of the running's been average too. Live and done at 65 for three.